um, topic, uh, one that I'd like to uh, chat to you all about today. So, um, I've been told to do so by several teachers, um, etc. I did warn them, by the way, just to pre warn you guys, um, not the cleanest of, of presentation. Um, but uh, yeah, it should be fun. But just to uh, just to let you all know as well, um, to stop you all girls getting offended here, um, not all boys who you've ever slept with have uh, been with as a boyfriend have done so just to get in your pants. Sometimes you want to get in your friends' pants, um, etc. <laughs> and for those um, who have had such experiences, um, let's get going. Right um, then. So, okay. Uh, um, yeah, it's, uh, as I said, it's a popular topic of people in school of the power age, and I can see by looking at people in this room uh, that they know what I'm talking about. Um, <laughs> God bless you all. And, um, <laughs> and yeah, underage sex in general, uh, it's illegal. And, um, <laughs> Yeah, it's apparently not very well accepted in modern society. Not with me, really. I think it's pretty awesome. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, for, uh, for the teacher's sake and for the pupil's sake, I'll just, uh, I'll stick to, I'll stick to the fire. Um, as <laughs> Sex and it's not very nice because it makes your vagina go funny. <laughs> um, some popular STIs could include chlamydia, syphilis, and HIV. But, um, yeah, it's not a very good idea getting them. And for those of you who have ever had them, and I'm pretty sure there'll be one or two people in this room who probably have some experiences. <laughs> Them because they can be easily treated, ladies and gents. Oh yeah, this is summer as well. The contraceptive pill. Uh, uh, <laughs> right. So it's not it's not really very useful in fairness. In fact, I would really bother because uh, um, if you've got to the point where you are stupid enough <laughs> to not use a condom during sex. Right, and you happen to get yourself pregnant because you're that thick where you've got to that extent at this age, then the contraceptive pill probably will help you. Just have an abortion or something like that. Yeah. Um, try else. Um, if you don't want a baby that is, and uh, I wouldn't imagine it'd be a very wise idea but having a baby at 14, I'm sure most teachers who are looking at me stunned at the minute would agree. Um, right then. So as I've said, unprotected sex isn't the best of ideas. Um, it can leave you ruined. Um, <laughs> when I say ruined, I don't mean like emotionally ruined. Well, I don't know. You'll feel fine in your head. You just have a strange-looking penis. <laughs> Right. So let's let's flash forward a bit now. Say that you've had sex to the extent where you've actually had a baby. How would you then look after that baby when you're still in school? You won't, would you? It, it just it's impossible because you're you're in two places at once. It's just ridiculous. Um, so my advice to all of you people are: uh, don't have kids when you're like fourteen because you've just been living your life, really. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, masturbation, right. Okay, so. <laughs> it is, it is advice. It is heavily advice. Um, it's a bit like farting, I think. Because, <laughs> I mean, you know, um, I mean, a lot 
people can do it, uh, but women pretend they do it. Uh, you do. I, I don't think there's many women in here who've never masturbated. <laughs> that would be ridiculous, wouldn't it? in an aeroplane or a funeral will probably be the worst place to move the masturbate or fat. So that would be ridiculous, wouldn't it? But like, um, um, okay, so let's uh, move on swiftly. Right. To conclude. <coughs> okay then. Um, it's not always a good idea uh, having underage sex. Something that I'd like to draw into your heads simply because a teacher told me to do so. Um, if you were to ask me about this outside of an assembly, I would tell you completely different. Feel free to have sex, as long as you, uh, as long as you don't go over the top, you know. Um, no one wants to be making porn at 14, do they? <laughs> uh, that would be a bizarre thing to want to do. Uh, so yeah, have sex safely, uh, if you're gonna have sex. Of course, if you want to remain a virgin until 30, and again, I can see several people who are going to end up like that. Um, <laughs> then, uh, you know, just, uh, just, I suppose that's not a bad idea, really, is it? Because uh, then you, you'll, be a, you'll be a party guy, won't you? It'll be great. Anyway, um, yeah, just be aware of the consequences. As I said, strange looking penis, um, <laughs> fat vagina, etc. <laughs> And uh, yeah, I'd like to I'd like to split this right into your head as well. Uh, just that word, that, that masturbation there. <laughs> it is, it is great. Uh, but um, <laughs> but um, yeah, just don't don't masturbate too much, though, because that won't be healthy. You'll just probably end up having smoke coming out of it. So. <laughs> That's my presentation you all today.